I'm Martha Higdon, National Educator for Handy Quilter. Today I want to show you what I did. I went to Pro Stitcher Designer and I pulled up Linda Mataloni's Happy Valentine's block and then I hit File and then I went to print and I printed out the blocks and then I used my coloring pencils. And so I colored out the blocks before I actually quilted them out. Um, I put it online, which one did you like best? Pretty much everybody liked the four pink hearts best. So it's always good to try them out with pencils before you actually quilt them out. So I'm gonna show you over here on my machine. It's a Handy Quilter Forte. And I have my neon pink thread in now, but I wanted to show you how I pulled it up. So I went to File, Design, Linda Mataloni's File. So I went to Open, um, I went down here to Linda, Linda Mataloni, and clicked on her, and then hers, here's her blocks. Happy Valentine's Day is the one I clicked on, and it came up. And so what I did is I um, actually let Pro Stitcher quilt it out, and then I went back in there with my ruler, and I colored it in with my thread. I'm gonna show you this one here is all four of the pink, which was neon, um, superior thread, omni, neon, pink, and then the red is the Magnifico 2047. And then I also use this twist fabric, which is twisted with red and black. And Mother Superior says this is not for quilting. This is for embroidery. And that's the reason, the reason why is because it's twisted and it's got red and black and sometimes the tension or the tension won't look right because it's twisted. Um, so I thought I'd use it on my sample. So that's what I've used on the on the other color that gives that red black And then this one over here. I went ahead and did the two pinks and the two red and now I'm just filling in the design I have my Omni neon pink ready to go and I want to show you what I use. I have my um, ruler base underneath I have my sure foot on, and then I am using my HQ mini ruler. Um, this one, I do not have any of the, um, the stickies on the back because I'm using this fabric that is kind of silky, um, sateen cotton fabric. So um, basically what I have here, um, I've gone back and forth. I've used regulated, I've used free motion. I've changed my um, time and stuff. Usually for ruler work, I'll use precision, um, but since I'm going a little bit faster, I'm gonna go ahead and use cruise. And then what I'm using, I'm all this is just straight line um, quilting to color in my design. I say go, and I'm going back and forth with straight lines to color in. And just back and forth with my ruler taking my time and I'm just coloring in the design as you can see. So thread quilting, thread painting, coloring with threads, it's a lot of fun, but it's also one of those that's very time consuming and you want to slow down. But it's great because you can use leftover fabrics, your leftover batting. My size is only 15 by 15, so my practice size is about 18 by 18, and then my design size is about 15 15. Plus it gives you a chance to try some different threads to see how you um, like how it quilts out. It's been a lot of fun and I hope that you also try this and um, send me pictures, let me know how it's going. Thank you.